Hi, in this video, I will show you how you can insert uh, inline pictures uh, inside a message in Maxbook Mailer. So let's launch Maxbook Mailer. Maxbook Mailer is our bug mailer. Uh, in Maxbook Mailer, by default, when you open a new document, the format is style text. In style text, you can insert uh, HTML code. Uh, I, um, you, are, you, will, you will use HTML code to insert that picture. So let's uh, type uh, the code. Uh, it is uh, EMG for image, SRC from, for source, equal to uh, quote. Uh, I will enter the, the URL of the picture, https um, slash slash www.maxbrog. Uh, dot com uh, slash in this case the folder is emg i know the url by memory and uh, cat dot g -E -J. okay we close the port and the tag okay we have in we have inserted uh, a picture inside our style text message that's simple that picture is online it is on the Mac Pro website, uh, you can use uh, a picture from any website uh, available on the internet, yours or not. So, if you go to the preview, you will see how uh, the image is automatically pulled out from the internet and shown the message. It is shown, it is displayed here on the preview, but it will be displayed to the um, re to your recipients as well, as long as uh, they have set uh, our message to show pictures. Usually, when a message uh, goes to the spam folder to your recipient, by default, pictures are never displayed. You have to uh, say to the mm, software uh, the, that message is not, is not spam, and then you can set to display picture. But uh, if uh, your message is legitimate and you go through all spam filters, uh, your recipient will see all the pictures. It's exactly the same as if you were sending uh, your picture as an attachment. The problem is when you send an attachment, the size of that picture uh, will, will, will be um, multiplied by, by the amount of recipients. Uh, if you send a, a picture of one megabyte and you have 1000 uh, recipients, this is a lot, a lot of bandwidth. So it is much, much better, much faster for you for sending and much better for your recipients to use inline pictures. So, uh, using this very simple um, HTML code to insert your, um, the, the picture directly inside the message. So you can see it this way. It is very simple and very clear and it's instantaneous. You can even uh, embed uh, the picture into a, a table. Uh, again, it is HTML. So you, for example, you, you enter table then you, you say, um, we, I want a new row, TR, TR. then I want um, a new column, and in that column, I want the picture to be displayed. I close the column, and I will close uh, the row, and then I will close the table. Uh, and if you preview, you will see exactly the same. So what's the point? Actually, uh, the idea here is the possibility to uh, insert, enter text on the right or on the left of the picture. For example, here uh, we can um, uh, add a new uh, column on the right here. It will be below in this case in the code. So we enter a new, a new column and then we write some text, uh, this is my new cat. And we close the column. And if you preview, now you see uh, your picture and the text on the right. You can write uh, text much more longer. Can, for example, multiply 
and copy this text uh, several times. And the text will be uh, available this way. There are lots of things you can do uh, with uh, tags, with tables, and uh, uh, with, uh, image, um, with image tags, HTML code. And I will do a, a, a video just uh, about this, uh, about how you can uh, enter more, uh, you can enter styles into your table, how you can um, uh, alter the, the image size and things like that. But uh, it would make the video a bit more complex. The important thing uh, right now is for you to understand that uh, a bit of HTML inside a still style text can allow you to do things quite interesting. Okay, I, I, I hope you, you like this video and if you have any question or want more videos about uh, this kind, please just ask me. Have a good day.